Hi guys, I'm Phil Town. What does a bear market mean and how does it affect investing? So keep watching to find out. So guys, there's Wall Street jargon out there for sure. And one of the things you'll hear is that we are now entering into a bear market or that we were just coming out of a bear market or we're gonna go into a bear market. Bear markets are kind of defined by Wall Street as a 20% drop in the major indexes. So the Dow Jones Industrial Average down 20%. When it goes to 20.1 from its high, we are now in a bear market. Or with the S&P 500, when it goes to 20 and a little bit, we're now entering into a bear market. And you're gonna find that the bear markets are a time when most people get very concerned about the future of their investments. Am I gonna have enough money to retire on? Rule one investors rejoice in bear markets. It's finally, we get a chance to buy these wonderful companies as they go on sale. So bear markets for our kind of investing are a really wonderful time. So right now, we are headed into um, what is called a bear market, right? We can, we, we've talked about that a little bit and we can talk about it some more bear markets when the market's down 20%. Well, we're down 20%. The Dow Jones just went down into a bear market territory. The S&P 500 is in bear market territory. And what that means is that the stock market is going down to a point where it is going to seriously affect the retirement of people who don't know how to invest, who have been trusting the financial services industry to tell them the right thing to do. And right now, what the financial industry is telling you is don't be afraid, just stay with it. Now, the only problem with that is that, for example, one of the world's great investors, Ray Dalio, has stated very clearly within the last couple of weeks that this market is very likely to go down another 30%. Now, what that means is if you're not out of this market, then half of what you have in the market is gone just down the road another year or so. Okay, that could create a crisis for you. So this is not a time to just sit and follow financial advice that's self-serving from the financial services industry, where what they're trying to do is to keep your money invested so that they can continue to get their fees and their commissions. We don't think that's the way to fly at all. In fact, we think it's extremely important that you look carefully at each of the things that you own, decide what's on sale that you want to continue to own and buy more of, what is way overpriced, even now that it's down 20%, still overpriced, then you'll want to sell it. So bear market right now is when the market starts to go down. It's the beginning of potentially a very big bear market, one in which People like Warren Buffett, Charlie Munger, people like me who invest like I do, our students are bound to make a tremendous amount of money. In this coming market, what we'll see in the next year or so, I think you're gonna see generational wealth get created. Generational wealth, not just a little, but the kind of wealth that lasts and lasts and lasts through the generations. You're gonna see that get created in this very, very unique market that we're about to go into. And if you're a rule one investor, this is a time for you to shine. Well, that's it for this week's video. If you're new here, or if you found this helpful, just subscribe to our channel for more education like this on a weekly basis.